welcome to the magic mirror today it's going to be about power rangers so go go power rangers that came out in 1994 and there's a lot to go through so without further ado warning spoilers for everything so uh, without further ado here we go i will start with the series because i actually uh, have been watching the series before the Power Rangers. I think they were called Dual Ranger or Dual Rangers. Uh, I will leave a link to them in the description down below. I think like Angry Video Game Nerd have talked about them in his uh, new review that I would recommend that you go and watch if you don't know what Power Rangers is because I'm not going through all of that i'm just going to talk about the series uh, the series that i remember the most from is of course mighty morphing power rangers but as i said i actually started out with the series before power rangers and were one of the ones that saw like uh, godzilla and power rangers and all of that good stuff uh, before it, uh, it came uh, later on and uh, I know like Nostalgia Critic is saying like he was too old to go on that bag bandwagon but I was actually also in that age range but I think like the, the thing with me having my brother that was younger and watching Power Rangers with me and having a great time was uh, one of the things that actually made me want to watch Power Rangers really bad but also remember like it being really popular at school it was uh, one of the things that we all enjoyed or how to say that so yeah uh, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers is one of my fond memories from when I was younger and I just remember Rita Repulsa I remember all of the monsters especially uh, there was a pig eating everything and there's like uh, of course a sword <laughs> that was that was really uh, hilarious and i think like this series is uh, one of the things that you should go and give a chance i will leave a link to the first uh, episode uh, down in the description below but i will warn you there is a lot of flashing lights in the start of the episode so if you have like a tendency not to want to watch stuff that has blinking lights i will warn you guys to maybe skip the intro or how to say that but uh, i think like the sounds and the um, intro and everything was just one of the greater things and of course when you hear it you can't help yourself being like go go power rangers and uh, like hearing that awesome guitar riff and all of that good stuff um, but yeah, Angry Video Game Nerd have already talked about all of this good stuff, so I think I will move on to the movies. The movies uh, is really good. Uh, the new movie is also keeping in the lines of like looking like the old uh, movies a little bit, just with a new, um, what is that, skin or how to call that. It still have the same like almost storyline and it still have the same villains and stuff like that so I think like it, that's really neat uh, I think like the swords are looking of course still amazing and with them like uh, summoning them uh, the old school way that's just uh, really good for your nostalgia if you're into that kind of stuff but yeah I remember like uh, my uh, favorite ranger was the yellow ranger so the saber tooth tiger running in the background or the t-rex getting summoned in the volcano or the mastodon being like coming forth and uh, blowing ice all over <laughs> so yeah I really do remember a lot from the series and a lot from the movies so yeah I really do want to recommend that you go and watch the um, older movies as well because even though that the new movie is good I'm still a little bit more fond of the old movies even the one with Lord Sed and the uh, uh, Booger <laughs> uh, monster or how to s uh, call them Booger boss and it's a little dis dis bit disgusting but I think like the old uh, movies just have a special nostalgic place for me 
uh, and I do remember in watching the series, uh, my f uh, besides the Yellow Ranger, the Green Ranger was also one of my favorite uh, rangers. And here we're going into spoiler territory because like the Green Ranger actually becomes the White Ranger. And that is one of the most iconic scenes I do remember from when I was younger. I was so sad with like the Green Ranger. I thought like he was dying and like him coming back as the White Ranger. That was just really cool. And like I still have that imprinted in my mind to this day. So yeah, and I know like that's both in the series and one of the movies. So I will leave uh, links to everything in the description down below, as I said. And of course, there's a lot of games. There's uh, all of the games under the sun that you could think about, the, like Power Rangers versus uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles and everything like all of these uh, weird uh, new games that are coming out. There's actually Power Rangers Online now and I have tried it a little bit. It looks a lot like uh, Mortal Kombat. So if you are into that kind of stuff, I will recommend that you go and try it out. Uh, it's free. So yeah, <laughs> if you have the time and you want to uh, try to see what that is. I will recommend it. And of course, there's Angry Video Game Nerd talking about all of the old Power Rangers games that I will show. Um, no, I will show a episode, the first episode here of the Power Rangers. And again, warning, there's going to be blinking lights and there's going to be um, all of this good stuff. But I didn't want to wa uh, show the games because like I think like the series itself it was more important to me than the games. I do remember that we had one or two uh, Power Rangers games for the Sega, but we didn't uh, play that that much. Um, Power Rangers games were not that good. And as you can see in the Angry Video Game Nerd episode, yeah, that's just the way it was. And of course, there's the Nostalgia Critic episodes talking about like the movies and like all of this good stuff. Something that I was actually really surprised about was that it was really hard to find the Power Rangers anime. Uh, I have not found any um, links to it. Maybe you guys can help me so I can put it in the links down the description down below. But of course, there's the Power Rangers the musical, there's Power Rangers fan stuff, there's Power Rangers like everywhere so yeah still to this day uh, power rangers are one of the most iconic things out there and things that we uh, like to talk about with all of the power rangers and the crew of the power rangers are still like uh, really nice people and you can go and meet them and they're still pretty cool to like actually meet and <laughs> have a, a good time with. I will actually recommend one of my friends that's called uh, Cameron Smith. I will leave a link to him down below because like I think he's uh, even a more uh, great Power Rangers fan than mo most of us because like uh, he has the turning into a Power Ranger or like uh, all of this good stuff with uh, meeting as I said one of the Power Rangers so I think like Power Rangers is just one of the more iconic things that I've been talking about with like uh, movies and series and uh, games and all of that good stuff. A thing that I really enjoyed with Power Rangers was that the music have been the same almost like all the through the seasons and all through the movies and games as well. So that's why you can sing along with the a theme song and you can be like yeah this is the Power Rangers it's going to be really great it's going to be something that's really special and nostalgic to you so yeah I will definitely recommend that you go and watch the first episode of the Power Rangers and even though like some of the things like Bulk and Skull and the robot going like ay 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 can be a little bit too much sometimes I think like the Power Rangers needs all of the uh, love and attention that we want to give it. So yeah, here is uh, to uh, Power Rangers and I hope that you guys enjoyed this episode of the Magic Mirror. 
I'm sorry that I had the budget for all of this extravagant intro, so I also would go like Mastodon, Sabertooth Tiger, Tyrannosaurus Rex, yeah, go Power Rangers, go. Uh, no, I don't remember the <laughs> correct intro, and I know that there's two more animals, like a, a something, but I, I will just leave it here and uh, let you guys go, and hope that you guys enjoyed all of this, and hope that you guys will check out all of the links down below. And uh, yeah, you remember to have a good time, so do remember that inspiration is right around the corner. Do remember to take care of yourself and loved ones, and that was actually all. Yeah, okay, bye!